Hello everybody, my name is Taylor Smith and I'm here with TransWest Truck Trailer RV here at the Broadmoor for our 2025 Newmar dealer meeting. And behind me we're going to be going over our 2025 Base Star Sport. It's a brand new floor plan, the 3016. So let's get right into it. Sliding over here to our Base Star Sport, you have three available floor plan options. One being the 3225 the other one being a 2813, and then the one we're going to be going over today, which is the 3016. You have three exterior paint options. The one that we'll be reviewing today is the Ocean View, and then you have Midnight and the Cayenne. Sliding over here to our storage compartments. Standard, we have the four 12 volt batteries, or you have an option to do six of the six volt batteries. Right over here, we have our storage compartments. Directly below that, you have a nice little three fourths quarter pass through. Awesome storage. Some more storage directly across. Over here we have the upgraded Cummins Onan 5500 generator, which is gasoline, which gives us the option to have the two 3500 BTU AC units. And in our last storage bay for the passenger side here is our water tank, our fresh water tank. And we'll go ahead and slide over here to the rear of our coach. We have our generator exhaust, the big beautiful window up here and then our camera system, which is directly above for that rear view camera. And then you have the nice ladder here to access the roof if you'd like. And then heading on over to the driver's side of the coach. Below we have our 50 amp shore power cord with the uh, surge guard protector. We have our HWH leveling jacks, and then another storage compartment here with a light. Here is our wet bay for our black tank sewage rinse and our fresh water. And then we have our dumps right over here. And you can slinky through right underneath there. more storage. And right here, our propane tank. And that will conclude all of our storage compartments here. We'll go ahead and get a beautiful headshot up here and then we'll take our take a look inside. As we enter the coach here, this is gonna be the stove decor and the dust chiffon maple wood, which is all new for 2025, is gonna be the two-tone cabinets. So you have the white up top, dark down below. And then we'll go ahead and make our way over here to our master bedroom. <clears throat> One thing I really like about this coach is the 30-foot coach and it has a king-size bed. You have an all new backboard here, all new redesigned. Storage up above with two charging outlets up there. Sliding over, another snapshot of our window, the uh, decent sized ledge right here. And then we have some blacked out mirrors, kind of tinted mirror here, which is kind of nice to have. Bed size, you can kind of see your outfit. And then storage behind it, plenty of hanging space. five drawers below. All of the drawers throughout the coach are going to be soft close. Nice little ledge directly above the TV here, which is our 32 inch Samsung TV. 
We have our Norcold fridge and freezer. Freezer here and the fridge. Slide on over to our kitchen. We have the Whirlpool. I love the little black appliances for the touch for 2025. Definitely adds into the whole residential feel. Three burner stove and an oven. You got three drawers here. Again, all soft clothes. Your undermount sink with some more storage. And then you have the single sink, there you go, stainless steel. Nice little nozzle here so you can easily clean out that sink. Storage up above. Sliding over here, we have our boot dinette, which does turn into a bed. Storage up above. Directly across from that, we have our couch, which does turn into a bed as well. And then plenty of storage up above. You can add some shelves in, if, in here if you'd like. And some more storage here in the mid of the coach as we make our way towards the bathroom. Plenty of shelves. Good sized pantry in my opinion. Alrighty, now as we enter the bathroom here, I'm just gonna go ahead and pop in so you guys can kind of get a feel of how big it is. You have the all new white um, shower surround with the stainless steel nozzles. And then you have the a little bit more headroom inside of there as well. And this is a 40 by 30 shower. So huge shower for it being a 30 foot coach as well as tremendous counter space inside of the bathroom. You have this whole designated, designated area, which would be perfect for, you know, womenly things as far as blow dryers, curling irons, you can literally set everything up. You're not trying to set it up all right here and everything's falling in the sink. So that was definitely a jaw dropping thing for me. More storage up above. And then this is our new redesigned multiplex management system. And then of course, some more storage directly across from the toilet as well. Perfect. Now we'll go ahead and get into the electronics. We have our 10 inch control panel over here. This is our KIB screen, which is also has an app that'll be globally accessible. So you can download that on your Android or your iPhone to control your tank levels, see your charging, HVAC. This is just to pair it. And then your lights, as well as all new for 2025, we have another touchscreen control panel, which will be in the front of the coach. So we'll just go ahead and shuffle over here, which will control your HVAC, charging, and then your tanks as well as lighting. And one of my new favorite features for this coach is where you can turn off all the lights with one click of a button and turn it back on. And over here, we have our nice little control panel as well. But I did just wanna show you, we have a huge well, a decent size bunk overhead that is accessible up to 500 pounds. And I'll go ahead and stow that away for you guys. Alrighty. And this is on the Ford F53. You have your wireless charging. 
your EQ systems leveling. And that is pretty much it for the changes for 2025. So if you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns about this new 2025 based our Sport 3016, you guys can reach out to me. My name is Taylor at 970-388-7937. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Have a great day.